Welcome back to Life Cheers here, and I'm Spencer. And I'm Ruby. Today we're going to discuss a review of what we thought about the 2022 film, Redeeming Love. Yeah. Well, first thoughts, when we watched this movie, I was just blown away by how they did the storytelling and just how moving the whole film was. Mm -hmm. I was blown away. I cried like a baby. Not gonna even lie. <laughs> what are your thoughts, honey? Yeah, so well, the movie was set in the 1850s California gold rush. Mm -hmm. So basically the plot is this farmer is praying for a wife. He's asking the Lord to guide him in his will. And he ends up going in town and seeing this woman and just knowing that that's the woman that God has for him. Mm -hmm. And this woman is... A prostitute. Yeah. She's been trafficked or whatever since mm -hmm. she was a very young girl and he, he sees her and realizes that she's a prostitute on the street and he sort of just chuckles because he's like, the Lord has a sense of humor. Yeah. And, but he, he's all in and pursuing her throughout the, throughout the film. She's confused as to why he would want her. He wants her and why he's paying to spend time with her in a room just to chat with her. Mm -hmm. That's not what her job is. That's not what guys do when they pay to spend time with prostitutes. But with real men, that's what he is. He's pursuing mm -hmm. her as the person that she is. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and throughout the whole film, it just kind of goes um, back and forth with the, the main character. Her name's Angel, um, whether or not she feels like she's worthy. For this man who loves her for her and not for her body and not what she can give him that way like he loves her purely and dearly mm -hmm. and it's like a godly love and yeah so throughout the storyline angel is just struggling with the sin that she's been so accustomed to in her life the the habit living just the life that she's always lived as unfortunate as it is but michael is continually persistent in pursuing her. It's just a beautiful film, so if you'd like to watch it, yeah, we would definitely recommend it. Mm -hmm. And It's definitely not for little eyes and ears, but it's still beautiful. And the main premise <laughs> of it is a brothel, basically. So. Yeah. Surprised it's only rated PG-13. Mm -hmm. You know how our world is today. Very yeah. lenient on that sort of thing. We both hope you are all doing well, and that the Lord continues to bless you. Mm -hmm. So... From life cheers to you. God bless you. Peace. 95.5% of you aren't subscribed to Life Cheers. To change that, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Our goal is 1,000 subs by July 16th so Spencer can have his dream birthday. God bless you.